Alright, hello and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3. We're now on part 21, and I decided to spend the money because we had about like um, 8,000 simoleons in our family fund, so I thought, why not spend it? I was going to put a pool, but it was too complicated, and I couldn't get rid of some of the foundation to make room for the pool, so I was... I said, you know what? <laughs> Screw it. Our sims do not need a pool right now. That's okay. And I upgraded some of the people's beds. And I think I bought a new dinner table and like some dining set china thing. I don't I don't know what that is, but it has wine bottles in it and it looks fancy. I think. Go love the creative style tool, and I'm sorry that I'm recording this right when I woke up. It's probably not the best idea because I am not aware of my surroundings right now, and I have been bombarded with schoolwork. But I decided I should probably make a new part because it's been a few days, so I apologize if I'm not as energetic as usual. We also bought a new fancy couch. That thing almost cost like a thousand simoleons. And I here I play with the tables because I like to play with tables. And I was going to buy another one, but I said, you know what? That's okay. We don't need another one. And I changed the carpet from white to dark gray. I don't know. I'm saying this when you can just see that, but that's okay. And we got a computer desk. Yes, we did. So now our Sims have a computer desk, an easel, nicer beds, nicer couch, and a nicer table. Alright, hello. Now we're back to playing the game. And the scout... Oh, he burnt his little muffin that he was baking in the oven, so that makes me a little sad. But that's okay, I suppose. Let's see. Eat the muffin. Eat your disgusting muffin. I'm pretty sure he has all this bad luck because um, Paris kept handling him when he was a little baby, so her bad cooking skills probably run rubbed off on him, but that's okay. He wants to buy a dollhouse so he can play with dolls, obviously. Suki is cleaning up the dishes. Okay, and they're all stuck at this little corner, tapping their feet for no reason. He's gonna go play guitar. I think one of his wishes... I don't know, I could have sworn he wanted to play at the park one time, but apparently not. And he should be getting a promotion soon. I don't know about Suki. Um, reports? Yeah, I don't know. I have not been taking care of my sins lately, because I've been busy. Let's see, Laura... Oh, they're all going to work. Shit. Okay. Kate's the only one that's not working because she's unemployed, so let's see who else. Oh yeah, we were working with Christopher to try to get her um, third lover. So let's do that. Hurry up and get up. Come on. Go, go, go. Call him over. Sure, I'll come over in a little while. Fantastic. So let's see, she needs... Why settle for a l Whoa, that little girl just popped up out of nowhere. I swear she did not walk up to my door. It's in The Sims, uh, paper girls actually have the ability to teleport to your house and scare the living shit out of you, but that's okay. Where the hell is this guy, man? Is that him? Okay, fantastic. So let's greet. Greet, greet, greet. Stop reading your book and greet Kate. Be careful though, because D Bag is in the room. They are friends. Okay, that's weird. That's like the fifth time I've seen that damn friend symbol. Let's see if we can go to. Uh, let's see, where should we go to? I guess we'll go to the park. Wait, oh shit, I didn't add. <laughs> I was gonna go to the park um, by herself, which would have been awkward because <laughs> you just invite a friend over and you just decide, hey, I'm gonna leave to the park. See you later. But no, Mr. Christopher will come with us. What's his last name again? Steel, that's right. Okay, and here we are. So now we will be romantic with this sir and try to get our third lover and then we would need just seven more to fulfill her lifetime wish. 
so we com complement their appearance and personality and I do a bunch of clicking and hugging and flirting and then we fast forward this because this is so fun and Suki and um, Paris both got a um, raise sorry I was reading something else oh shit 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 okay Mr. Aiden scope okay did he he's not upset still can we apologize apologize okay wait is he leaving he's leaving he's like I don't want to get involved with this bitch where's he going where are you going Christopher Christopher okay Christopher you're being such a dick right now let's see visit the theater with Christopher maybe that will be better that's the problem with this uh, lifetime wish is I swear like I don't know I'm really bad at um, trying to keep the relationship a secret I suppose like it's hard for me to do that but that's okay let's see so they're both in there and we're going to do the making out and possibly the woohooing of but we won't we won't know for sure oh nope there are definitely hearts going up there those are hearts. When does D-Bag have work? Because, uh, let's see. In three hours. Okay. And Christopher's at the park. So, let's see. We will confess attraction. Oh, he thinks that she's being alluring. Okay. Romantic. And, um... Okay, good. They're lovers now. See? So, now she's the rom our romantic interest of Christopher Steele. Aiden Scope and a uh, d-bag so now that we've done that we should find someone else uh... let's see is there anyone here um... um... okay hold on how about we go to the graveyard cause uh... when i'm looking for a date I go to the dead to ask for a date because I'm a freak. There's no one at the graveyard. Why would there anyone be at the graveyard? I kind of disappointed. Let's see. Um. Oh, you know what? This is the Goths household. I wonder if they're still alive. I mean, I've been playing for not a long time, but for quite a while. So they might be old. Uh, Paris just got a promotion to a report processor. Which is cool. So she just gave us money. More money that we don't need. Like seriously, I'm completely okay with the house now. Um, oh shit, he has to go to work now. Oh, he's a cook apparently. Uh, who is he chatting with? Oh! Applesauce. Friendly introduction. Cyclone Applesauce. Used to be a Cyclone Sword. Kate is going to go after the old family that I don't play with anymore because I kind of forgot I was even playing with them. So we're going to greet and he is skinny like a twig. But we will make fun of him by saying, hey, look, I'm like a twig. Great jokes. Great, great jokes here. We're going to ask if he's single even though we know that he is married with, um, wait, are they married? I don't think they're even married. Or I could be wrong. Oh, what? Suki just got a promotion? Dang, she's fucking more. Oh. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, so. Oh. Wait, okay. Hold on. Oh, there's D Bag. Don't do anything. Don't do anything, retarded. Don't, don't flirt with him. He's right there. Retard. She's at work. That's okay. Anyways, as I was saying, here, let's do more. Apologize. Ask about career. Gossip. Chat. What the hell, man? What the hell? He is such a jerk. I don't even know how a Amanda Applesauce got to marry him. What is... He's... He's wearing eyeliner. He's wearing eyeliner. He's a, he's a jerk. That's what he is. We're gonna try the silly face again, even though... We know it didn't really work that well. But as I was saying, damn it. <laughs> I keep getting sidetracked. Uh, both Suki and Lara have their own patrol cars now. So 
I'm wondering if this is in their um, inventory. So let's see, is it? Oh, I forgot we stole these. Oh, this looks kind of goes with the couch. I'll change the pattern later. I'm too lazy to do that right now. And, uh, do we need, what's with them stealing lights? We have like enough lights everywhere. We can just sell this. And then this is like garden light. Ugh, <coughs> sorry. Okay, well, time is running out, so I will talk to you guys later, okay? And hopefully we'll get this guy to be our next victim of love. So I'll see you then. Bye.